John Proxy on channel John of the West. I'm having a World of Warcraft World of Draenor adventure. And uh, luckily I've got all my garrison stuff done out of the way because it's broken again. So let's talk to Flox. Dr. Flox? I don't know. I found a weapon. Yes, I did. I found a sword like right there. Uh, I did it in between videos. But um, let's follow Flox man. I don't know what he's doing. I sort of, um, I think I'm helping out the uh, orcs, aren't I? To Naz Grimm's wife. Wow, estranged my wife, let's say. Oh, let's kill this Gloomshade Howler. Oh, you're such a howler. Uh, let's, don't say that, John. Don't my words to be misconstrued. But yeah, every time I can't go forwards with this character, I try and do it with my other character, and he's in the garrison, so uh, that's actually not doable. Let's help this person out who seems to be standing still getting attacked. I was going to say there's some, some charity, but his, his guild's called Clarity, not Charity, whatever. He'll survive. He gets proper wings. My guy, my rogue has kind of weird, just blue things that aren't really wings. But whatever. It's Flox. What does he want? Just to investigate the field. Oh, I can't. There's a howler here. Alright. It's not a lion shield. It looks like the shield belonged to the missing search party. Upon further inspection, you find what appears to be hundreds of little puncture marks covering the blood-stained armor. Ooh, it's a right mystery, isn't it? Uh, what does Flock think? He's very muscly for a plant. His eyes are huge. You found armor, no friend in reach. You find more clues at the beach. And if it rhymes, it must be true. That's... 100% how that works. Uh, sorry, Fox. I spy a node. And I'm going to have to get the node. It's very important I get the node. I need I need plants to do my uh, alchemy order as well. Where are you? There you are. There you are. Starflower, yes. One more Starflower and I can do that alchemy order. That I can't do because I can't get into the garrison right now. But hypothetically, I could. Do the war coder. There's Flox. Yeah, I think we... No, we did see the start of this mission. We just didn't see me pick up the sword. There's a dead pack mule. You'll find yourself thousands of tiny puncture marks covering the dead mule's body. Oh, dear. So I can't remember why I'm investigating. I sort of misplaced that. But um, I hope he doesn't mind if I do some herbalism on this dude. Their mounts are dead. They must be saved. Well, he's a very nice plant, dude. Uh, final clue is in the cave. So, um, it says grotto there. And, uh, only two types of things live in grottos. That's Santa and monsters. And, uh, well, it's almost the season. But, uh, let's get on the mount. We don't have to literally follow him. This isn't a roleplay server. Uh, oh yeah, I can do herbalism on, on, on the mount. It's cool. So if I see any, I'm going to do that. Just ignore the dogs attacking me. Have we not been in this grotto already? I oh, know I said that grotto comment is back on a different video. More plants. Ooh, there's Jared Hamby. That's better. Oh, Fox. Ah, oh, fool, I tricked you from the start. The time is now. I swallow your heart. Gah, oh, he's not a nice plant at all, that bastard. But I've got a touch of death, so, like, nothing scares me. Oh, what a git. That bastard. Tiny little marks. It was his marks all along. Ah, I think the light. <coughs> I didn't think I'd get out here alive. It's Jared Hamby. Jared is clearly injured. He winces in pain as he begins to talk. My lead forest operator, Shelley, she's being held not far from here. I've got to kill King Deathbloom. I'm fairly sure my followers have killed him several times. But uh, I get myself a tunic for my troubles. Uh, hopefully one doesn't pair my furry chest so much. What about Ryan Metcalf? 
pruned the podlings. The blood-soaked body of Ryan is slumped ah, slumped up against the cave wall. Tiny teeth mark cover his body. The podlings clearly are a threat to you and your your garrison. It's time to do a little pruning. Sorry, sorry, I said that wrong. It's time to do a little pruning. Uh, let's take revenge on the podlings. Oh, but they're adorable. Uh, there's a spider. That oh, battle area is. You're lucky. Battle area is obstructed. Um, where is that? Oh, it's gone now. Ooh, captured critters available quest. But there's loads of quests here. I'm, I'm gonna have a goddamn efficient video. Of, of, of. Well, I might as well pick that up. Oh, it's a captured critter. So this poor critter is about to be poddling food. It would be pretty easy to set this little guy free. Right, let's through the critters. And uh, gather some herbs, yes. So, uh, yeah. I, these guys are a godsend for, you know, this this part of the game, the release day. This is hunted to dead people giving me broken frostweed stems. So, yay for that. Uh, no. Oh no, he wasn't picking that up. Right, my herbalism, herb, herb, my herbalism, my herb, herb, my herbalism is 625. That's pretty good. That's quarter of the way there. We're only in the first zone. I don't need to fight that fun guy. I do need to kill Podlegs though. Who are now bad. Let's do those kicks. Oh, he's dead. I see a skull. I'm pretty sure that's the King Death Blue. That I have to kill. So I'm going to go towards him. I'll drive through that critter, of course. This is a critter, man. There's hundreds of them. Thousands. Millions. Just if it's a rabbit. I mean, who says the podlings can't eat, right? They live here as well. Just because they're not cute. And they are cute. What the hell, game? What the actual hell? It's disturbing these bastards. Ecology. Wow, oh, I, I, I'm taking revenge on them, aren't I, actually? They did try and kill more people, so. Screw them. It's a big one. The little one should take care of himself. That's not true at all, is it? Little nibbler. Just gonna murder the nibblers. Do I feel bad? Yeah, constantly. But uh, not about this. Let's so remember, I do have AoE. I do have a slightly more efficient AoE than that. That's great. Let's do the lazy version of AoE. How the hell do I get to there? Where King Dudu faces? No, that's not King Dudu face. Who the hell's that then? That's Sporian. Oh, I don't need him. Uh, let's go for number six, right? Just keep rolling. It's coming. Hmm. So I went a bit quiet. Um, I'm going towards the furthest um, quest, and then I'm going to come back around. If all that makes sense. I'm going to try and do this set of quests efficiently and move on, because I'm a tad behind. Maybe Kazra is no, that's the grotto. Well, those guys disappeared. Alright, I've done. I've fell into this trap already before. Why are you doing it again, John? You can't find anyone on the bloody coast. Well, I am at Umber Fen Point, though, so. So I got a bit cold. Uh, it's always annoying. I, I have to record this now, right? It's the only time this stuff's pertinent. Uh. 
My rogue can warp on water. So all these things I miss my rogue. God oh, damn it, I hate the coast. Because yeah, I'm just trapped, there's nothing here for me. And I, do I keep going? I'm just wasting time right now. Come on. Why do you have to make such a stupid coastline? Let me get to the places that it's pointing to. Alright, it's obviously not going to let me on until I... Oh, no, no! Oh, may have got lucky. To be fair, that is exactly where Carl's... Kralzer. Kralzer. There we go. And it's UL. I keep pronouncing her name wrong. But uh, I just did that bit on my other character, so... It's UL. It says her name out loud. Who are you? Don't need you. Oh, giant moth. Oh, yeah, now you want dead giant moth. I feel like I shouldn't be doing this yet. Never mind. I found Carl's Krasler. What the hell's your name? Could you stop running? I need you. I'm sure you'll turn up. Oh, Luna Blossom. There we go. Quest stuff. Isn't that lovely? So these skeletons are pretty new. That's not a surprise, to be honest. Let's go in this grotto. Yay. Uh, there's Dolmak. Oh, Dolmak wasn't to be trusted. Alright, I'm in the circle bar. Probably shouldn't be in the circle bar. Oh, it's a dark apparition. That wasn't Dolmak at all. Thank goodness. This isn't efficient fighting at all, John. Come on, John. Step it up. No, it's not ready. This is where a touch of death would have come in handy, but never mind. There we go, Dark Apparition has been slain. Not sure what happened to the Dolmax, but uh, the quest is done. Uh, but not quite yet. There is true iron here. Let's pick it up. Very shiny. Wonderful. That's on the 621. So we're certainly getting there. Um, let's go towards that 6. Let's get the Lunar Blossom first. While we're in a place with Lunar Blossom in. I think that might be sensible, right? Getting the quest done. <coughs> Sorry. Getting the quest done. Uh, John, you just rolled past the Lunar Blossom. What's that line? Is there? Howling Void. Well, I think the garrison's a tad broken. I'll go back when I need to and see if it's available. Uh, I'm pretty sure I can move the uh, garrison to the next country, uh, with the next you know zone, which I'm going to do so. Just so it's less broken, less laggy. And then Luna Blossoms. Now, let's get ready to rumble. Oops. Whatever. Let's go kill stuff. We're looking for critters and podlings. Let's see how you're supposed to get here, not by the water. Maybe you are supposed to get here by the water. Well, certainly a journey of sorts. Ah. <sighs> Mount Kralgor. Yeah, because you couldn't get here via this way. Hmm. Maybe you were take, supposed to take the water. Who knows? Oh, the blizzard's south probably there, actually. Ah. Thanks, guys, leaving all these herbs around. I appreciate it, I really do. No, I'm not going to give him presents or anything. I, I appreciate it as much as I'm going to say out loud that I appreciate stuff. That's pretty much how far my appreciation goes. Damn, not important. Not important. Get the herbs. They're important. 
Get myself a primal spirit. Alright. Doing quite well, I reckon. Feels like we're doing quite well. We're doing quest things, we're getting flowers. Everything's coming up. Proxy. Whatever, I don't know what that's supposed to mean. We're not getting that flower. Yeah! So yeah, these are... These... These are one of the two annoying little critters of the game. Because there's the Tasmanian Devil thing as well. Got that roll around in my mind's combination of this and that. And the new Murlocs. Essentially. I know, but I can't reach wherever that is. It's Mad King Sporian. I guess it's in a cave or something. Hang on, I know about a cave. No, uh, this is where you're getting unefficient again. Let's kill these dudes. What do they sound like? What goes wah? What about morks? Wow, well, killed. Handed in that quest. Let's go. You wanna, you wanna start, dear? No, I don't think he did. He's dead now. He's dead at the time. Right, captured critters is not priority. Everything is priority, dog. Stop biting things. I'm trying to be efficient here, Captain Efficient Man. Not really a superhero name, to be honest, but uh, whatever. Captured Critters, Alchemy Work Order, King Death Moon. Right, let's go towards that totem. Alright, let's go s south. Oh, I can't go south, whatever. Let's go around. After we pick up these lovely flowers. Don't need any more of those dudes. I'm not fighting anymore. I'm moving on. Oh, those uh, raving rabbits. That's, that's what makes that noise. I cannot do that yet. Alright, there we go. That's not going to bug me anymore. So I'm going to go down, around, and up. Actually, this is where my quest thing is, so. Maybe I can hand in. I'm looking for a totem, right? Uh, in a cave that has the names of all dead people on. Let's kill these squirts. But give them adorable names, I'm having to kill them all. Don't squirt. Alright. Take these guys out and then we can think. We're gonna pick up whatever's on that as well. So I'm right on it. Let's read this. In the cave beneath Exile's Rise. Well, there's a cave around here. Am I in Exile's Rise? No. Where's Exile's Rise? Because obviously the cave can move out. Oops. Doesn't say where Exile's Rise is. Tell me locations of things and not. There's a cave there and it's got nothing in. Quests like that. Well, I suppose I. Should, look for things obviously but for quests like that it would be nice if they pointed the cave entrance and not to the random hole on the ground which is not very useful for me.
No, leave that frog alone. He's done nothing to you. All right, it's giving me this massive blue area. So let's think of it in terms of the massive blue area, right? Pick up that plant as well. There'll be a cave somewhere around here. So I've suddenly not become inefficient again, which is kind of annoying, but... Let's pick up this plant. And the thing about the totem is, it's the quest line, it's the important quest line, so... That takes me to the village. Well, we can hand them in, I guess. Oh, hang on. Exiles rise. No, that's not why Axel. What was it? Is there like a cave in here that I just missed? Hmm. Ah, uh, Akam Magosh, monk. I knew that the Void Witch was no good. That's, that's Krasla's out. That's his resolve. Kralza. It's not hard to pronounce. Kralza. To drink it, I should put it on. Go forth to victory. It's probably a couple of things I probably should put on. No, not that one. Why is it? Could be clever about this, but it's not. That one. A free. All right. Uh, yeah. Whatever. Let's not dwell. It's a question mark around here. There we go. It's Luna Blossom. Luna Blossoms, you are too kind. I can't wait to give these to Cadler. Be safe. And there is a dot. Where the hell is that dot? Not there. I appear to be in the right location. Maybe it's under here. I mean, that is what's being described, right? Alright. Under Exiles Rise. So maybe there's a cave entrance just like off here. Like down here? Like right there. Yeah, that looks like it. Alright! Well, that was fortuitous. Let's click on the uh, totem. When the Iron Horde came, they gave our clan a choice. Join them or die. My husband, Nezul, chose to save our people. He joined the Iron Horde, but they asked of him a heavy price. They said, What good are stars and visions against steel and powder? Make a worthy offering, or your people shall die. So Nezul turned to the silent void. He broke the ancient laws and drew upon the dark star. I pleaded with him to stop, but he would not turn back. By breaking this stone, he forswore all <coughs> loyalty to our ancestors. You must do what I cannot. Stop Nezul. End his madness before it is too late. The Shadow Moon Fortress is sealed to outsiders, but this keystone will allow entry. Good luck, hero. Alright. So that's the story of Nazul. He would, of course, later become the Lich King. Our people deserve better. Oh. Grats. Uh, our people have always drawn from magic from the Earth and Moon. Okay, well, I've read that one already. So, Ancestors' Memory, I get some Legards. We will find new traditions, my people will become something new. It's a complete quest. Put these trousers on. Gonna have to sell these at some point. So, Darkest Night. 
This keystone will grant its bearer entry into Anguish Fortress. Take it and meet Prophet Felon outside the Shadow Moon Fortress. He intends to face Nazul head on. All right. Ancestors, forgive us. Well, can. Prophet Velen spoke highly of you, and I can see that your weapons are keen and your intent just. I sense great potential within you. If you will allow it, I will warm you up my hands by your fire for a while. I would like to follow you and learn from your people. In return, I shall fight for you. What do you say, Traveller? I get Ruckland. She's level 92. I get Nazul's wife. Hey, she's a blacksmith. Yeah. Do what must be done. Lovely. Right, uh... Well, I'm going to let you guys go. I've been John Proxy on Channel John of the West, having a world of Warcraft. Warlords of Draenor Adventure. See you guys next time.